This year's postseason is off to an absolutely incredible start. Mark Vientos, he has been having a great start. He's going to go deep. So the Mets were going to take a 2-0 lead. Pete Alonso homer. It was a 3-0 lead. And then in Citizens Bank Park, there were a lot of boos for a quiet offense. That's until Bryce Harper takes Luis Severino, who's pitching great up to this moment. 430-plus dead center. That's going to be a two-run homer to get the fills right back in this game. And immediately right after it sparks the bats because Nick Cassie he was going to get in on the action as well, but then right after, Brandon Nimmo gave the Mets a 4-3 lead with a homer. A lot of homers in this game, but Bryson Stott in the bottom of the eighth off Edwin Diaz, who was trying to go for an extended save. He's going to hit a two-run triple, so that makes it a 6-4 game, and everyone was going absolutely insane. You talk about Red October. These Philly fans are some of the best in all of sports. But the Mets, ever since the Phillies pulled Zach Wheeler yesterday, have hit the bullpen of the Phillies with ease, and it's going to be Mark Vientos. He got the scoring started with a two-run homer. How about a two-homer game and four ribbies for the young slugger Mark Vientos? So it's a 6-6 game at the, tie. at the time. He had some big swings in Milwaukee as well, but then in the bottom of the frame, they had to bring out Tyler McGill, and down to the final strike of the inning, Nick Cassianos. He hit a homer earlier. Now he's going to deliver and is going to be the walk-off hero. So game one, Zach Wheeler dealt, then the Phillies blew it with their bullpen. The Mets won 6-2, to two, and this game, it was just back and forth, back and forth. It was never really comfortable. Mark Vientos tied it. The Mets had all the momentum, but Nick Castellanos would then deliver the final blow. So at the end of the day, it is a 1-1 series, both games being very crazy in their own right. They're going to have Monday off, but then things will be taken back to City Field.